I've learned about a lot of artists so far. I liked Mona Lisa because all the detail in it. Well, I really like how Leonardo da Vinci used the background because it had some cool rivers. He uses like dark colors and light colors. It's just like a really good mix. We've done the print rhino. We've done the Mona Lisa, the Campbell's soup can. It just helps me to express my feelings and how my creativity can come out. I felt really happy when I finished my art because it looks really good because it's just fun. I am a great artist. 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 I think art is what makes life enjoyable. Having a basic knowledge of art and color and texture is going to help you in every aspect of your life. I mean it helps them when they pick out their clothes, it helps them when they pick out colors in their house. It's a great outlet for children to feel creative and to be able to express themselves. And once I think their eyes are open to art as a child, it becomes very much what they see and do in everything. It gives them a real sense of purpose when they know that they're good at something. I think it really does carry over into their academic areas. It helps their mind think. It might instill in them a love to be an engineer or all kinds of different um, occupations. The teachers have to figure out their own art things. And as everyone knows, not everyone is creative and is a great artist and without any sort of guideline, it's hard to come up with something that's not just kind of a craft project. When the kids are just tearing paper and gluing and cutting, they might be having fun because they're using, they're manipulating a medium, but they're not having that sense of accomplishment that comes from really drawing a foundation of a real great artist piece and having it look like that. The Great Artist Program, in a nutshell, is a simple volunteer-based art program that focuses on six artists a year. Students can learn not only about an artist that's being featured, but they can learn about a famous painting or work of art, and then they learn about the technique behind that. The volunteer will come in and give a short summary about the artist. A little bit of art appreciation will also have a really great full poster that we can point to colors and shapes and be able to talk to the kids about their thoughts and feelings about the arts. We talk about the, the poster and, and I ask a couple of questions related to that poster and what the kids like, what the color they like, what the shapes that they can see. And then we have what we call Let's Create a Masterpiece and that's where the kids actually sit down and the volunteer has a step-by-step -step instruction sheet that uses simple lines and simple shapes for every kid to be able to draw a foundational drawing. It's broken down into simple steps that the kids can follow and they're able to create a masterpiece that is very much like the artists that they are studying. And sometimes the fifth or sixth graders can be a little talkative, but once you start drawing, they are just right there with you and they want to see everything that you do. They want to follow every shape, every square, every line. Then they get the opportunity to color it in using lots of different mediums and techniques and being able to put a little bit of their own spin on it and really feeling like they're the great artist of their paper. And it's so simple that every child is successful in being able to produce a piece of art. It has so much jam-packed into that lesson plan that it becomes such a joy. There's nothing like seeing a light in a child's eye when they understand a technique and then they just go crazy with it and have fun. So not only do they end up learning about the artist and about the technique, but they also produce something in the end that they can be proud of. It's not very hard to prepare one of these lessons. I come in, I set up about five minutes early and set up the pictures, set up the, the supplies that I'm going to need, and I'm good to go. I was worried that it would be hard, you know, to, I'd have to really <laughs> prepare, but it's, it's so, the way it's laid out, it's so easy. The lesson plans are really designed for any parent volunteer, no matter what their level of artistic ability, to go in and teach a really well-designed lesson. Our volunteers keep coming back and doing it again and again year after year because they love it so much. Most of the parents, in fact, that come back, they say, I can't believe I just taught that. I've never had, I've never felt that I was an artist, but I've been able to go into a class and teach this whole class full of kids, and the kids are just amazed at how well they do. And I think when you see things happen in the classroom and you can experience and know that you're part of the genesis of that excitement toward art, 
it's really fulfilling. Parents far and wide are visibly surprised at what their children are able to produce. They cannot believe their kids can do these things. The kids absolutely look forward each month to the one day that we will be able to do the Great Artist Program. They're just kindergartners, but they, they just really soak up every bit of what we talk about. I got a phone call from a parent who said, I don't know what you did that day, but um, my son is so excited and he's trying to show me what he did at home and he remembered the steps that um, were followed and so then he began to cre recreate the same picture at home. It's amazing how, how much confidence the kids come out with. They, they are artists. They are great artists. They're coming home with great art that's, you know, frameable. Our program is really inexpensive compared to many of the programs out there. The schools are understanding that this is a great value to their students and that will um, enhance their education. With our school, it's a no-brainer. I mean, to have parents come in and teach something that teachers have a hard time getting to in the curriculum, to have them come in and do all the preparation and bring all the artwork and inspire and motivate the kids was, was easy. The whole faculty was on board and the kids love it. When it's all said and done and they hold up their papers and they have that huge smile on their face, it absolutely makes everything worthwhile. Ah!